My Hands Sing the Blues, Romere Bearden's Childhood Journey, written by Jeanne Walker Harvey, illustrated by Elizabeth Zunon. I snip a patch of color and add a cutout face. Oh, I glue on jazzy blue for sky and add another face. People walk into my work as if it's always been their place. My hands sing the blues when I paint and cut and paste. I never know what I'll create when I paint and cut and paste. I use paper, fabrics, photos, and nothing goes to waste. Today my memory whirls back to my North Carolina past. Swirling days of hot July, picking berries in my past. Just then a train roars across my canvas with a loud and steamy blast. I am back as a boy, talking with great grandma down the old dirt road. I'm walking with great grandma down the old dirt road to the land of the Cherokees from where her stories flowed. Rocking on her creaky swing, we hear the crickets chirp. We feel the humming of the magnolia mill and hear the crickets chirp. We gulp down warm tomato slices trying not to slurp. Riding up on great grandpa's shoulders, I'm a strong and mighty tower. Resting my chin on his head, I am a strong and mighty tower. We're watching the good trains go by hour after hour. We know every train by its swinging whistle tune. Each engineer plays a different whistle tune. Like the Atlanta New York special, sizzling through at noon. The trains cha-chunk, cha-chunk on by. Woo-woo, woo-woo, one more round of whistles. Woo-woo, woo-woo. Wah wah dee doo, whir whir dee whir, wah wah dee doo. Then one day I'm waiting on a bench for a train to roll on in. Mom and Pop and me were waiting for a train to roll on in to take us to New York where our new life will begin. From the south to the north, many more have gone before me. Riding on the railroads, many more have gone before me. Wanting to be free like the wind blows through a tree. From somewhere down the track, I can hear that whistle blow. I tap my toes to the beat and hear that whistle blow. Woe-dee-woe, the locomotive slides in slow. Lifting luggage up the stairs, the Pullman Porter nods at us. Standing by the sleeping cars, the Pullman Porter smiles at us. But we can't go in the sleeping cars, and we're not to make a fuss. Tears sting my eyes when I hear the call, All aboard! I hug Great Grandma and Great Grandpa, then I climb aboard. I settle in my seat 
and I wonder what we're traveling toward. Tink a tink, tink a tink, the engine picks up speed. Kanuk kani, tink a tink, tink a tink, bye bye, Trade Street Station. Kanuk kani, with a thrumming and a drumming, the train hums a tune to me. I press my nose against the glass and watch the world whizzing by. A patchwork quilt of greens and golds, the world whizzing by. Farms and fields of cotton, roosters pecking bugs nearby. I spy a woman by a wash tub, stirring, staring up at me. I wonder what she's thinking, staring up at me. Maybe that tomorrow so far away I'll be. The train glides, glides us up to Harlem, New York City. That's where I am right now painting what's inside of me, sharing stories of my past and the joys and fears inside of me. Like a flower, I have roots in my Carolina past, roots sunk deep into my childhood long past. The people and places are in my art to last. When I begin something new, I take it slow and steady. I let myself become my art and take it slow and steady. I'll lag behind the beat until I'm sure I'm ready. I want my art to touch each of us so we can understand. I want to follow roads from secret places so we can understand that the blues sing for each of us all across the land. I am like a singer calling out, then holding back. I am like a trumpet player blowing loud, then dropping back. When I put a bead of color on an empty canvas, I'll never know what's coming down the track.